about the current state of affairs. Hello everybody and welcome back to Diana Moon Media Bunker. We are continuing on with Speaking of diversity, Blizzard's Overwatch won Game of the Year in the GDC Awards. It is one of the few games that contain playable characters of various races, ethnicities, nationalities, and sexualities. With Tracer, a confirmed lesbian, headlighting the game in most of its marketing, this is a huge step for the queer community. Because it's not just about how a game looks or plays, it's also about respecting your true audience and giving everyone a chance to identify with someone. Puzzles really aren't that hard, and they're kind of obvious, but apparently not that obvious to me. But that always feels that way when you're playing something. It's like, oh, this is simple. I can do it. Anyone can do it. Come with me, spirit. Um, and then you're playing for an audience, and that all changes. I had a fortunate opportunity to work for Tanya to pass of I Need Diverse Games. She needed someone to man the table because she was unfortunately at another convention that was happening at the same weekend. So I took care of that. It was part of Inclusivity City, which is what Twitch decided to add on to TwitchCon, which was an area where people could talk about the things we don't really talk about in game industry, or there's a few people that have been talking about it, like I Need Diverse Games, but hasn't been reaching like the broader audience. So I was happy to be there to represent her nonprofit organization and doing what I've been talking about, um, critiquing games that does have diversity or lack of, and trying to help people get into it, try to raise up the voices of the people who are already trying to get into it or just started and have games or opinions. So that was really fun. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, no. It's a cop. It's a cop. It's a cop. I mean, I'm used to just like say, just lying and never ask, anyone asks if you're okay. It's like, yeah, fine. <laughs> but I'm going to tell the truth. Oh, damn it. I'm just trying to stay awake. You look down at your feet in shame. I lost. I don't have a home. And I don't have anywhere to sleep. I sleep in a student uni universe, union at the university and her eyes narrow. 
We sleep at the university. He pulls out her radio. This is the first time they caught you doing that? Fucking cops. Why did you think you could trust them? Oh, where did I? I was hoping. The re- Ugh. Damn it. I knew better. I think that's the guy, dude. There's some Star Wars character extended. You know, that was so stupid. What the hell? Why? Why did I do that? Sorry. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now that's not all you get. Let's say you're having a Marvel watchathon. You gotta eat. So, why not share case all of your nice edibles in this fancy? dish set featuring very famous Marvel scientists. We have Iron Man, Tony Stark, Peter Parker, Spider-Man, who was in science film. Many people tend to forget that. Bruce Banner, aka The Hulk. And as I mentioned earlier, Hank Pym, Ant-Man.